And yeah, I think we should start really because I've been talking to you guys. And this is for culture for you. I am a cultural comedian, a lyrical social comedian. I felt I had no choice but to change my voice to appear average by mean, mood, or medium. I studied hard to fit in and be cool for as long as I've been able to speak. Although not to stand out at my school, I had to learn a talk common, not Latin or Greek. Me have to pick up my patois in conversation. Me need to call me did too. Because if you're not first generation, it might not come natural to you. I've delved deep in all sides of my history. Something I believe every person should do. Because if where you come from is a mystery, can you be sure that your heading is true? So to stories of Romans and Boudicca, I had Maroons, Garvey, and Shaka Zulu. And ensure the light of the Lady of the Lamp never obscures Mary Seacole from view. My biological heritage is both black and British, and yet some really do seem to feel that my need to pay subs to both these cultural clubs is somehow less than real. Like some BNP or National Front, jumped up run, son of an Enoch Powell influenced, ignorant grunt who wants us all to go back! <laughs> to our historically correct geographical homes. Well, hold on. Mine split by over five hours of time, and that's a little harder to straddle than a couple of travel card zones. Forget that this Patriots Queen is Franco-German. The suggestion of this lunatic is the place I should feel most at home in is floating somewhere over the mid-Atlantic. One toe down in London town, the other in Kingston, poor wretch. Better put me on the rack right now, cause me legs, them just won't stretch. <laughs> my left side is waiting for me breakfast, see? When me right side, she's had me lunch. I guess if I'm confused, stuck in between, I could always just do brunch. But from that lofty spot, I could appreciate many artists that have shaped our current world view. Great bards from Tough Gong to Billy Wagadagger, known as Marley and Shakespeare to you. The Windrush might appear through time's mist to me, as it answered the mother country's call. Those aboard unbowed by their history, each with a right to stand proud and tall. Slave routes back to Africa would be visible too, a journey so many did not survive. Britannia's involvement is shameful, it's true, but I'm so proud that I am alive, for my DNA's very existence is a testimony to my ancestors' persistence and my parents' tolerance, even when surrounded by overwhelming ignorance. It is a unique blend of Aboriginal British bloodlines and those of the invited immigrants. So, yes, I am a cultural comedian. A lyrical social comedian. And now, by choice, I change my voice to appear more than average by mean, mode, or medium. Thank you. I hope not too much has lost in translation.